Preview Anthony Scaramucci was sensationally fired from the White House after just 11 days as communications director. But who was Anthony Scaramucci before he made worldwide headlines sacked White House communications director Anthony Scaramucci? Picture supplied Anthony Scaramucci, a.k.a. The Mooch, has more words for Donald Trump in his first interview since he was sacked from his job after 10 days. In an interview with ABC America host George Stephanopoulos on the program this week, Scaramucci claimed that President Trump is still fighting an enemy within the White House. I think there are elements inside of Washington, also inclusive of the White House, that are not necessarily abetting the president's interests or his agenda. I absolutely believe that, yes, he said. When asked to be clearer about who was behind his claim about an enemy, Scaramucci said he had previously referred to former White House Chief of Staff Reince Priebus and Chief Strategist Steve Bannon in a rant that was recorded on tape by Ryan Lizza of The New Yorker, and led to his sacking. Former White House Communications Director Anthony Scaramucci points as he answers questions from members of the media before he lost his job. Picture app source ape in that interview, Scaramucci said then White House Chief of Staff Reigns Priebus is AFG schizophrenic and that I'm not White House strategist Steve Bannon. I'm not trying to suck my own CK, he also railed that he would F can kill all the leakers in the White House. Today, despite losing his job, Scaramucci still claimed President Trump should alter his strategy if he wanted to bring in his own agenda. There's been some strategic changes and my guess is there'll be more strategic changes. I think the president is getting his arms around the fact that if he wants to prosecute his agenda he's got to bring in loyalists to him. He's got to bring in a different strategy to the one he's been deploying, he said. Sacked White House Communications Director Anthony Scaramucci in his first interview after being fired. Picture supplied source supplied A's done a tremendous amount. He's done way better in terms of progress as president than has been prominently displayed and one of my heartbreaks is that I wasn't able to effectively communicate that to the American people. Scaramucci also compared himself to the Hollywood character of Winston Wolf from the cult hit Pulp Fiction, who is called in to clean up the mess of a murder. Listen, I saw it more as like Mr. Wolf from Pulp Fiction. You know, I really did get a directive from the president, he said, I had a mutual understanding with him. And I was probably running too hard and acting more like a corporate CEO than I was say a political operative, and that is my mistake. And I have to own that, appreciate it Gustafinopoulos fairness today. Looking forward to it Colbert Liddy Show tomorrow night. HTTPS T.co8CJDZJOGZW Pick.Twitter.com If Ike 6 hhx Anthony Scaramucci at Scaramucci August 13, 2017 Scaramucci then went on to say he made an unforced error, and it led to his dismissal. There were leaks and there was a repetitive process to try to dislodge me, he said. I made an unforced error. That made it easy to dismiss me, Scaramucci also warned President Trump not to make the same mistake he did, the president is not a representative of the political establishment class, he said, and so for whatever reason, people have made a decision that they want to eject him, it's almost like he's opened up the door now for America's CEOs and America's billionaires to enter the Washington political system. I see it as a strong CEO that's now the American president that's making counterintuitive decisions that may not be liked by the members of the media, but may be in the best interests of the people of the United States. Former White House Communications Director Anthony Scaramucci walks down the steps of Air Force One. Picture app source up at the end of the day, I think the president has a very good idea of who the leakers are inside the White House. The president has a very good idea of the people that are undermining his agenda that are serving their own interests, he also added. When asked if he was referring to Bannon, Scaramucci said well, yes. Look, I mean, we're not on a phone call, and a taped phone call. And so we're on live television, and so I would prefer to let the president make the decisions that the president needs to make. He warned that there's this sort of Bannon bird influence in the White House that is a snag on the president. When asked by Stephanopoulos if that influence stemmed from Bannon, Scaramucci replied, I think the president knows what he's going to do with Steve Bannon. Scaramucci also distanced himself from other claims he made in his discussion with Lizza that got him fired. Former White House Communications Director Anthony Scaramucci blowing a kiss after answering questions in the White House in Washington. Picture app source ape in that interview he said he had obtained digital fingerprints from the FBI of administration officials who had leaked information to the media, that was totally misconstrued, he said, I was just implying that, at some point, the Department of Justice would be able to figure out who the leakers are inside the national security system. Mr. Scaramucci said he thought his talks with Lizza was off the record, though he said he never discussed the rules of the conversation. 
He said that, based on their prior relationship the conversation should have been off the record, I made a mistake, he said, I'm accountable for the mistake. Scarmucci also took questions from his followers in a live QA on Periscope. Ask the Mooch taking your questions HTTPS mpg 3s Anthony Scaramucci at Scaramucci August 13, 2017